Hey everyone, welcome to a quick After Effects tutorial. I got a question in the Complete After Effects course from Lisa on how to create text blocks similar to this where you have a block of color and then the text is actually a window into the background. She sent me this project right here. Let me just play through the first second. You have this first little part where this motion array text is seeing through the background and it's actually relatively in simple so let's go ahead and create a new composition or you can work on a composition you're already working on the first thing to do is create your text so I'm just going to say sample right here I have a stroke on this text so I'm going to turn that off so here under my character settings I'm just going to turn this stroke all the way to zero and you can see that I've used a pretty thick font so you want to make sure that it's something pretty thick so that it can uh, really show the showcase the um, whatever's behind th this text I'm also going to add just a video clip here's a video just of <laughs> me making Dutch oven bread <laughs> and so that's a good backdrop sometimes different backgrounds don't work as well depending on how bright or dark it is the next thing we're going to do is create our shape layer. So go up to your rectangle or whatever shape you want to choose. Choose your fill and then make sure nothing is selected down here and create a block. So I'm just going to create a block. I'm going to drop this shape layer below the sample, our text layer. And then I'm going to use my align panel, which you can get to from window align to align this text so that it's centered with the block behind it. So I'm just going to select both the text and the block layer, center align it, and vertical align it. So now it's perfectly centered within that block. Now I can go in and change the size of this block if I want, make sure that you know there's generally equal spacing at the top, bottom, left, and right of these letters. Now what I'm going to do with my shape layer is under track mat, which is right here, change that from none to alpha inverted mat. So alpha mat will make the actual color of this shape layer in the text. Alpha inverted mat will invert that so that the text actually shines through whatever is behind here. So that's pretty much a simple way to do it. What I would do after that is parent either one of these to each other, I would parent the shape layer to the text. So now if I take the text and I move it around, the shape layer also moves around. So then if I want to do a little size animation, so if I say scale, bring up scale with S and set a keyframe and I move this forward to around one second and then I decrease this size, something like that. And then I select both of these easy ease of them with F9 on my keyboard and then play through this. You can see what's happening to this text. So the black box behind it matches the animation of the text. Now to get what we did on this animation where you can kind of see what's happening with the text kind of going down, you would just animate the shape behind it. You would use one of, I actually have a tutorial for how to easily reveal shapes and layers. So that is a good option to check out. And um, otherwise, uh, that's pretty much how you create this text. Hopefully that helps Lisa and to everyone else who is wondering about how to do this. Thanks for watching. And as always, check out videosgoonline.com for more tutorials and premium courses related to After Effects and all sorts of other things. Bye.